Alright, what's up everyone? It's your boy, Uchiha Kusanagi here, and we're back and playing some Pokemon Masters. Last time we left off, we got Flannery in our team. We beat her in the Volcanic um, Panic. Yeah, and now we unlocked Chapter 4, but we're going to finish Chapter 3 first because we got to do some field work with the Professor. So, let's continue. Eager to learn more about the teaming, Battling Kuzunagi made his way over to Professor Bella's lab for some advice. Oh, hola, Kuzunagi. Welcome to my lab. Thanks for coming. So, how you been? How are you teaming your team battling going? Great. I want to learn more. Subarishi. Uh, I forget which language is that. I'm pretty sure it's French, I believe. I'm not sure. Uh, li tell me in the comments if that's like f that word's like French or a different language. But that's great. It sounds like you're accomplished quite a lot in a short amount of time. I'd love to see what you can do. I know now that I know that's from French. As a matter of fact, I think I have the idea. Will you mind joining me in some field work? There's a trail, a trail in the mountains nearby that would be perfecto. Are you ready to leave now? Let's go. All right, let's the field work begin. Why don't you try ta tapping someone on the shoulder and get a conversation? Conversion? Wait. Conversing a happy smile and a and a aloha should be the trick. Oh, she said I can tap. Oh, okay. So it's kind of like a little exploration they put in. Did I just find a pokeball with some stuff? Ooh, that's pretty cool. Right, let's go. Let's go talk to her. Hmm, I wonder how can I get my hands on a sink stone. A sink stone? They're so shiny and pretty. I'd like to be so cute if I can get one. I can make one into a hair clip. I heard they can be only found in that special spots in the oceans around P Pasio. Well, so what are you doing over here? <laughs> right, let's go talk to this hiker. With his graveler. I see, I see. So you two have been building your trust in one another for decades now. How wonderful. Yep, this one and I have been rolling together all our, our lives. Wonderful. Wonderful. You can be almost past for twins. People don't say we don't look alike for nothing. Okay, is that... Whoa. Oh, hold up. I'm pretty sure I explore everything, so yeah, we just go. Just keep moving forward. That's pretty cool. They put like a little bit, like, ex free roam. They put a little bit free roam into this game. I kind of like it. Oh, let's go talk to this guy first. Uh -huh. God, your Pokemon was. Just so lonely that I couldn't help but stare. Here, take this in as an apology. Oh, he gave me some more of those. Oh my, it's even more lonely up close. Oh, I'm in love. Aren't Pokemon just the best? Let me look at your Pokemon's a again sometime. If I remember. Uh, that's pretty much it. Wait, any Pokeballs around? No, I don't see any Pokeballs. Alright, so let's go talk to these peeps. Hey, it's Professor Billis. What you doing? Hmm? Field work. Oh yeah, of course, field work. I love field work too. Uh why don't we have a Pokemon battle, you know, for field work? Uh sure. I'm going all out.
By the way, what is fieldwork? Fieldwork is something that gets us very excited. Oh yeah. Oh, I get it. It's like a field day. They both got a word feel in them too. Oh, I get it now. Bravo. I can tell that you already form an incredible bond with your Pokemon. Speaking of which, has anyone told you how to sync moves with work or why we're able to use them in the on Pasio? It has to do with some things called sync stones. Have you ever noticed that there's a shiny rainbow color stone in, in bar, embarded in your Pokemon, your Pori phone? There's a sync stone, they're quite rare in fact. They are, can be only found right here in the ocean where Pasio was built. And the interaction between sink stones and Pokemon is actually the prime subject of my research is quite brilliant. Sink stones are amplified with the power that comes from the bond between the trainer and their Pokemon is called sink strength. Tapping into the sink strength is what allows us to use sink moves as you demonstrated that we make battling on past your special. The more you the more you and your Pokemon develop your sink strength and your bond, the happier you'll be as a sink pair. In the end, the real reason I'm count continuing my research now and focus on your sync strength and try and use your sync moves again. Okay, so let's just continue. Dude, this is gonna be a little bit long because it says like. Because it says 4 out of 5, so it's going to be a teeny, a teeny bit. Wow, 10,000 coins. But it's going to be a little bit long. Hmm, I wonder what's going on right there. Let's go talk to this kid. It's important for sync pairs to have strong bonds, so we can use strong sync moves. So we need sync strength and sync stones, of course. Wait. Is that right? I said the word sync so many times that I'm not sure anymore. Uh, anyway, you have to use a lot of regular sh moves before you can use your sync move, okay? At least you, that, uh, that's what I heard. Nah, I already know how to do that. Professor Villas, what's going on over here? Hey there, senorita. Mi corazón is going... Donkey, donkey, <laughs> because you're so pele que pasi. How about tu e and je uh, have a walk conmigo? Sorry, I have no idea what you just said. You have to use your words properly, or else no comprendo. Well, that's well. There's nothing here, so we just keep moving on. <laughs> My Spanish was a little bit off. <laughs> mm -mm. Mm -mm. Oh, what's these guys doing here? The ranger and a prof and a scientist. Oh, and an ace trainer. Therefore, we can conclude that communication is cr cruel critical. Crucial in team battles. So, what you're saying is the team member all had to be on the same page, correct? Well, practice make perfect. Hey, look, some trainers. Let's battle my team against yours. Hang on. I'm not ready. Don't go challenge people all on your own. Oh, shoot. Right. Communication. Sorry. We're going to need a, a rain check on that battle. Pokeball. Yeah. No, you're looking for an opponent for a Pokemon battle? Bingo. Yo, get on a great Pokemon battle. Uh, yo, what? Speak English, Doc. We ain't, we ain't scientists. Anyway, you're looking for a battle, right? Ooh, ooh, I think this will be our last battle of the day. 
What do you say? Win this match and end in the field with a bang? Do your best, Kuzanagi. You ready? Wait, wait, hold up. Don't worry, we ain't going anywhere. We'll be here when you're ready. Tend to battle, babble on endless whatever the subject of sync pairs comes up. But you see, it's my job as a researcher to spread the information I discover. Hmm, I expect my magnificent, magnificent things from you, and I hope you go on and to become a fantastic sync pair. Do your best. Your sync pair and attack defense are temporarily raised. Oh. I can tell that a little boost of encouragement has really lifted your spirits. And it's if it's passed by, if kind enough to give you an memorable boost, I it can make you feel like a little stronger for a while. Remember that. Okay, sweet. Okay, now I'm gonna challenge you. Let's go, hiker. Yes, sir. Another hiker, Jared? Are we having that rematch from last episode? Bubble beam. Energy ball. Thundershock. Time to energize. Bubble. Kind enough with them, the ball. Perfect. Perfecto! My, my, you're really getting the hang of how Pokemon Battle work here. I'm glad I was able to observe you up close today. The Emporfito fieldwork has been so helpful. To create an even playing field, we've given a, every sync pair their own Porifone to use while they're here on Patio. Since each Porifone contains a Sync Stone, everyone has the ability to use Sync Moves. As I explained before, as your bond with your Pokemon grows, your Sync Strength and I'm as partner grows too. I'm sure to be share my new and helpful information I can cross that as I continue my research, okay? For now, I think our field work is complete. Thank you very much, Kuzanagi. Ta-ta! That was a really good, um, uh, okay, guys, I feel like we did a lot on that, because, ooh, I'm pretty sure this was going to be a little bit long of an episode, because of the exploration, but next time on Pokemon Masters, we're going to start Chapter 4, from Bud to Blossom, and look, looks like we're going to meet up with Erica. so tune in next time on the episode that we're going to tackle on Chapter 4. Um, this is Ch Uchiha Kuzanagi signing out.